Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. I'm just going to tell you up front, this one is an absolute blast to play. I highly recommend it. There's a lot of really neat special rules and you're on a, you have a mission and you got to do it quick. And uh, it's, um, yeah, it's based on the, it's based on a episode of Band of Brothers from HBO. And it's the last patrol of Easy Company at Agano in France and uh, really, really cool. Excellent scenario. It's from the scenarios of the scenarios from the front, from the Days of Wonder site, and uh, I can't recommend it enough. I love it. I've played it four times so far, and each time was great. So enjoy the video and definitely try to get this one to the table. It's awesome. Same deal. I'm going to show you the setup and the historical background and the uh, details for it about five seconds at a time and you can pause the video and read those. You're really going to want to do that for this one because there's a lot of special stuff and uh, really, really neat ideas and yeah, I just, I just love this one. It's a blast. So enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Okay, let's get it going here. The Axis start with six cards, or uh, the Allies start with six, Axis starts with two, and then draws up to four, one per turn. So uh, over here we've got a Recon on the left, Recon in the center, two in the center, three on the right, two on the right, and a one in each. And since I'm strongest on the right, that's what I'm going to start with. I'm going to start with a two on the right. And it's going to be this one and this one. And they're going to fire at him <clears throat> with one each. Let's say this guy first. That's a hit. Okay. And then this one, another hit. Okay. All right. Strong first turn. Let's see what the axes have. Oh, let's take a card first. There we go. Direct from HQ. That's pretty good. Two starting cards for the axis is three in the center and all on the right. So uh, just a note here, I'm using an extra figure instead of the medals that the, that the um, special rules call for. Um, one of these is going to be a prisoner and the other one is just the the three guys of the unit so um, just wanted to point that out Let me clear that off okay so uh, well we got to do the three in the center right because there's don't really have anybody to shoot out there so we'll do the three in the center and we'll do that one and that one and nobody else is in range um, Okay, so we're going to go the artillery 332 on this guy. And that's a flag. Go back to there. A flag and a tank was the roll. And then 332211. Let's try one again on the same guy. That's a hit. Okay. Okay. And now we draw a two to get up to three. Well, that's a two on the right and an all on the right. Wow. So we got an all on the right, a two on the right, and all on the right. And uh, just a note here on this scenario, it's really neat. The idea is awesome. And one thing I've noticed is that it's uh, very, very kind of swingy depending on what cards you get. I mean, it can be... It can be a real tense battle, or it can be they just come up and grab two and go back and it's over. So um, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. But when you start out with three right cards and nobody to shoot at, it's not so fun. So let's switch over to the, to the Americans here. All right, since we got that direct from HQ, I think that's probably, probably our best card. 
And uh, so that's four of my choice. He's going there. And he's going there. He's going to take a lucky shot at the artillery. And then um, the other two are this one. And he drops a raft on the river. And then this one. And he also drops a raft on the river. And nobody's in range for them because when you're shooting out of a raft, you're minus one. So they would both be shooting two, and then it would be two, one, and he's in a town, so that's protected. So they don't have range on anybody. Um, so yeah, let's do this guy here first, and that's with three. Two hits and a flag, so he's done. It's not a medal. You only get medals from the prisoners. Okay. And now this guy with the lucky shot on the artillery. And that's an infantry symbol, so that's a miss. Okay. And we'll take a card. A move out. Gotta love that. That's, that's about the perfect card. Well, I don't really have a choice here. I'm going to do this two on the right. And uh, three, two, one. He can shoot at him. These guys can't be targeted because they're on the river. And then I'm going to move him over. Or should I put him here so that he could be ordered still on the right? Yeah, all I've got is right cards. I better keep him within, within shouting distance if he needs an order. So I'm going to roll one on this guy from the artillery. That's a star. <laughs> okay, and now we draw two. Uh, infantry assault, that's good. And another three on the right, wow. Bomber. Well, that's how it goes sometimes. Okay, so we're gonna play that move out. I think that's pretty obvious. And he's gonna continue up the tracks. And he's going to also go over the tracks. And he'll fight. He'll fight. And then the, with the move out, we're going to move these two guys up. And they are going to fight. Okay. So, um, let's do this guy on the artillery. And that's rolling two. And he's got uh, no retreat, but he can ignore the first flag. Uh, one flag and one star, so that is not a hit. And uh, this one here with two. Or should I try to take out the artillery? Mm. No, I think I'm going to go for the prisoner. Um, a retreat gets me the prisoner, and then I can deal with him next time. So the infantry... A grenade and a star, so that's one hit. Okay. And he's done. And then um, let's do let's do this one first. If he has to retreat, then he can still shoot. Um, so that's with two. And a flag. A star and a flag. So he's not dug in. Um, he's not dug in, so he has to retreat and leave the prisoner. And I will take ground and snag the prisoner. Okay. And then he will shoot two at him. A grenade and a tank, so that's one hit. Okay. And take a card. A two on the left. Okay, boy, I'm hoping this doesn't fizzle. I've got a three on the right. I got a two in the center for him. And uh, I've got a one in each if it gets that desperate. I hope it doesn't. So here we go. Well, this infantry assault certainly gives us a chance at some glory here, doesn't it? <laughs> it doesn't give you a plus one, but... You can order every infantry in one section, which is great. So uh, let's go over here, and we'll leave the prisoner there. And then 
these two are going to fight and I'm trying to decide how to do this right here um, I can go I can bring him to here and then him to here um, but then he can't really do anything so I could have him go there and block the retreat which would be good and again put him there and him there and then this guy over here to shoot one um, I might as well right we need to kill this guy to get our prisoner back so let's uh, let's play it aggressive so let's go here to block the retreat and then here and he'll shoot he stays in the church he's the prisoner the the one the wannabe prisoner and he'll go there and he'll go there this is this is desperate but we need to we need to keep our prisoners on this side of the river <laughs> so okay so um, let's go Let's go this guy here, and um, the railroad bridge is no protection. So let's do, uh, we'll go three from here. And that's one hit and two stars. Okay. And then this one here, also with three. That's three hits. Nice. Look at that. Two infantry and a grenade. So he is done. He's done. They flew a little clue to they flew a little too close to the sun, I'm afraid. <laughs> well that's that's good for the Germans. That's real good for the Germans. Okay, so uh, let's do this one here with one. And he's got uh, he's got no retreat, remember. So that is a star, which is a miss. Okay. Um, let's do let's do this one here, and that's with two. And that's one grenade and one star, so one hit. Um, and let's do, let's do this guy here with two. That's two hits, an infantry and a grenade. Okay. So we're down to one guy. One guy holding the prisoner. And this guy here with two. Two hits. Two infantry symbols, gotta love that. Okay, so this is another metal. And and I will uh, I will take ground and shelter that prisoner. And I wonder does that guy's raft disappear? I wouldn't think so. I mean in real life it wouldn't, so all right. Um, well, that was good. That was a good turn. Um, do I want to take ground, though, is the thing. Yeah, I kind of have to, because if I don't, he'll just walk in and get the prisoner next turn. Um, I'm just looking at this, because now he's got no retreat. Um, and I'm sure he's going to try to do something, but we're ready. We're totally ready now. This is, this should be a... This should be a win for the Germans if I can just keep getting us some center cards. Um, that's the trick, though, right? Ooh, three on the right. I have a three on the right, a three on the right, an all on the right, and an all on the right. And this is my only unit. Wow. Oh, man. Unbelievable. Okay, uh, we got to do this one in each. 
Um, that's going to be the best. Uh, this this guy is. I think he's toast, but he's got to he's got to try to get the prisoner. We're we're uh, we're behind enemy lines, and there's really nothing nothing to do but try to try to bring a prisoner back. So it's desperate. Um, that is my one on the right. My one in the center is uh, this guy. He's also trying to get a prisoner. And then my one on the left is him, and he's going to drop a raft in the, in the river. Okay, so let's go this guy here with two, and that's no retreat. A grenade and a flag. So that's, he's out of, out of the game. And I will take ground and scoop up that prisoner and hope I can survive back to the exit. <laughs> All right. And then uh, this one here with two also, and that is also no retreat. All right, that's an infantry symbol and a flag. So same deal. It goes there. I move in and scoop up the prisoner. And this one's out of the game. Okay. Now it's just a race for the exit. Oh man, this is this is crazy. A two on the left, not great. I've still got the two in the center. Uh, the two in the center is going to be these guys trying to get the heck out of there. So. Um, Two in the center, then a three on the right. I got a I got a two in the center for them, and then I've got a recon that I can get him back, and then a three on the right. Yeah, this is going to be tough. I need a I need another one in each, or another general advance, or a move out, or an infantry assault, or whatever. <laughs> well, this is frankly kind of boring on this side. I've every card I have is on the right so it's a three on the right and ordering him I can't target him because he's uh, on the river but uh, three two one I can target this guy with one die and that's an infantry symbol so that's a hit okay and something other than left a recon in the center <laughs> okay Okay, as predicted, we're going to do the two in the center to get get the boys moving to get them try to get them back back home. So that's one, two, and he'll of course fight. And then my other in the center is him. He's going to make a run for it, and we'll take we'll take this raft. Uh, well, let's leave it there. It might. Might remind me of something, I don't know why. And um, in the raft, uh, in the river, he battles out, so he can shoot two at him. Okay. And yeah, that's it. So let's go here with two. Um, an infantry and a flag, so that's a miss. And this guy here with two, two infantry symbols. Okay. So. Let's take that off and see what we get here. A two on the right. Not great, but. Um, yeah, I think. Um, well, we need to get them both going, but this one's weaker by one figure, and as soon as he gets across the river, he's uh, he'll need to come here first, and then here. This one, I think I'm going to head for this exit, because once he gets on the road, then he's got three movements, so that's only two turns, where here it's one turn, two turn, three turns to get to the exit, so we'll, uh, we'll do that. Um, yeah, so that's it. Well, my only like really useful card is this one in the center. So I'm going to play that. I'm just trying to decide between this guy and this guy. I think I'm going to go for this one because he's already weakened. 
So we're going to go there, and that's roll in three. And that is an infantry, a flag, and a star. Okay, so one hit, a flag, and star is a miss. The flags actually help the Americans now. That's, that's kind of tricky. And that's it. What do we get? Artillery bombard. <laughs> this poor guy is, he, he's going to be feeling that artillery bombard, I guarantee. <laughs> well, we just have to deal with this. I mean, that's all there is to it. Um, yeah. Um, we're going to go two on the right. And he's going to go there. Um, if I go here, it's still he's still shooting two at him. So we just have to put him there and hope for a miss. I mean that's really that's really all I can do. And he doesn't have anybody to shoot at, so and that's my only one on the right, so what do we got here? Another two on the left. Okay. Well we got a if if this guy fizzles, we can at least try try something on the left here. If uh, if this guy gets killed, this one was here, and this one was here. So just for my own reference and remembering where the where the uh, where the guys were. So let's switch over. Well, obviously it's going to be the artillery bombard. And each one can battle twice. Uh, this one can't target these guys, but he's uh, three, two. He's in range of him and him. So he's going to shoot. And remember that this guy can target him. And, uh, yeah, so let's go over here. Let's go uh, three, two on him. That's one hit. Okay. And two more for the second battle. Two infantry symbols. Okay, so that's a medal. And our prisoner comes back. And he's done battling. Okay. And then now this guy, 33221. Three, that's a flag, so that's a hit. And then one more. A star. Okay, so he's done. And boy, that really takes the wind out of the out of the paratrooper sails now, doesn't it? Uh, three, three, two, two, one, one on that guy. That's a grenade for a hit. Okay. And one more. Infantry symbol. So that's a hit. Yep. Yeah, artillery bombard card really makes makes this a a swingy kind of thing. If um, but now again, I'm just back to this guy. So, but I need three more medals. So um, he's he's going to make a run for it, and he may actually make it. But I've got I've got him, and I've got a bunch of orders on the right to try to slow him down and get the guy back. I think if we can kill this guy and get that prisoner back, that's basically going to be it, because there's no, I mean, there's just no, they'd be, it'd be a suicide mission after that, so. Uh, three on the left, okay. Um, well, now that, now that he's going to be on the other side of the river, we at least have somebody to shoot at, so. And uh, prisoners, three prisoners here, let me, let's do this. We'll, uh, we'll lay these guys down like they're sleeping so we know who they are. And then if he ends up uh, getting eliminated, this prisoner was here. So, all right. Well, I'm just, I'm really, I'm just not seeing how this, this is going to be possible <laughs> to pull out the win on this side. So, I mean, I guess you could just send them all and try to kill everybody and then just, do you know then just if you eliminated everyone then it would it would be over then you just 
But if you then again, if you did that and didn't have a card to actually walk them back to the exit, it'd be like a stalemate or something. So, but anyway, I'm going to do this recon. I'm just going to keep the game going here. Um, I'm going to go one, two, and try to get him to the exit next time if I can. And so this raft is gone. That was used twice. And this one was for one of the dead guys, I guess. And then um, that's it. I'm going to look at two cards. And I got a medics and mechanics and then all in the center. Um, now that I'm outside of the river, he's shooting two, he's shooting three, two, one, and three, three, two, two, one, one. He can't, he's out of range, so I'm thinking that that medics and mechanics get him full strength. So he's, he's shooting three, three, two, two, he's shooting three, three, two, two, one. So no matter what, I'll be able to get this guy off. Okay, so I don't really need that medics and mechanics, but I could use it for him if it looks like they're gonna get a medal. Um, or the all in the center. Yeah, I just don't see it. Um, I'll keep, I'll keep the, no, I'll keep the all in the center. I probably need movement more than I need healing. Um, okay, that's it. All right, I'm going to play this uh, three on the right, and he's going to shoot at him with three, two, one. That's a hit. Okay. Yeah, I think that artillery bombard was pretty much the end of the game. I'm even considering packing it in. I'll, you know, I know he's going to get off, but there's no way that these guys are going to get one of these and get back. I mean, it's just not, not going to happen. That's uh, air power. Okay. All right. Well, I might as well play this recon on the left and get him off. That's uh, one, two, three. So that's a prisoner. And then his movement stops for the turn. And look at two cards, an infantry assault. I'll keep that infantry assault. This one's a three on the left. All right, so I'm going to pause and look at this and see if I want to continue or not. I think it's, it seems like it's uh, a lost cause at this point. Um, yeah, so I'm going to look at it, and then I'll be back. Well, I'm going to play a couple more turns at least and see how it goes. Um, yeah, so it's the Axis turn. <laughs> well, probably ought to do this air power. That's probably the, the highest, uh, the, the highest powered card, so, and obviously it's going to be these three. Let's, uh, it's one die per hex, and let's start with the single guy first. That's a hit. Okay, so that's... Four. We need two more. Um, uh, this guy here with oh, I should have done. I should have done this one first. No retreat. Well, it's a mistake. Um, that's a tank. Didn't really matter anyway. And then the guy on the baseline is grenade. Okay. Yeah, it's not not looking good for the. Allies, I think I think on the allied side. I'm just I'm gonna do what I said and have some fun and just try to kill everybody <laughs> See how it goes <laughs> Yeah, it's definitely feeling like a lost cause here, so I am going to I'm gonna play this infantry assault and He's going on the river and then he can fight so he's gonna roll one at him and then this guy is gonna go one two and Attack him so one die here, that's an infantry symbol, so that's a hit, okay, and then this guy here with three, and that's two hits, okay, but we need to remember 
that we need to leave one infantry alive. We need to leave one Axis infantry alive because when all the infantry are gone, then the artillery can shell on their own side of the river, which we definitely don't want because that'll be the, that'll be a quick ending. All right, counterattack. All right, here we go. All right, I'm going to play this one in each. And of course, he's on the right. And then I'm going to move this guy down and fire at him. And then on the left, I'm going to move him into the town. Okay? So the artillery on him, 33221. And that's a star. Okay? And now this guy here with two. And that's two infantry symbols. Okay. We're getting there, we're getting there. I'm sure I'm sure plenty of people have bailed on the video and I don't blame you at all, because it's it's a matter of time, I think, at this point. Alright, and a three on the left. That orders him, which is okay. So here we go. Well, I'm going to continue with the kill them all, let God sort them out plan here. I'm going to play an all in the center. And I'm going to go there. Attack him. And then this one's going to attack him. And we're going to hope for some lucky rolls. <laughs> so this guy here with three. And it's two hits and a tank. So he's done. And then... Um, I will take ground, and then this guy here with three. Oh, you gotta love that. Three hits, two infantry, and a grenade. <laughs> so he's done, and oh, maybe, maybe they will pull this out. This is crazy. Well, now, now maybe this guy just wants to give himself up. So then the artillery can start firing on these guys. Well, this one this one got interesting again. Um, I'll take ground. Yeah, this one got real interesting all of a sudden. Because all we need to do is grab him and get to an exit. There's no, there's no raft here, though, that's the problem. <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> we got to get all the way back to where we left our rafts. Oh, jeez. Yeah, okay, well, let's take a card. And that's a one in each, okay. Well, the problem over here is I can't order in the center. I got two, three on the left, which is him, and he's got nobody to shoot at. And I've got two all on the right, and he can shoot at him, I guess. So let's do that. Try to get something we can actually use next time. So he's shooting at him with one. And that's a hit infantry symbol. Okay. <laughs> and a two in the center. There we go. That's useful. All right, I'm going to play this one in each. And I'm going to um, trying to decide if I should protect him because this guy can just pop out and get him. But if he does, I don't really want to kill this guy though, because when if this guy, if I kill this guy, then the artillery are are just going to shred me. So. Um, well, I know, I know on the left I want to do this, okay, and then should I just try to take out the, the artillery? I think I will. I'm going to do this guy on the artillery with two dice. <laughs> Check it out. Two grenades. Okay. That made it interesting. And yeah. Wow. <laughs> this is a great scenario. I thought it was over and I was just going to be bored. But uh, well, I got to dig in, which is not great. 
But um, wow, that that changes things for sure. I think I think this guy is just gonna come at him. But uh, we can just ignore him. We can just run from him if we if we have to. Because we can go to well, he can move to, but he can't fight to. So um, the problem is I can't get this guy. I can't pick him up because I don't have anything in the center. So, all right, well, stop jabbering. Let's play. So the only two cards we can do anything with is a two in the center or an all on the right. The all on the right would be him shooting at him, and the two in the center would be this guy coming out and shooting at him. And uh, since we need a medal, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go two in the center. He's going there. Rolling two dice. Two grenades. Okay. So there's that. We need one more. One more metal. Well, if I've got any hope here, I need to grab that prisoner. So I'm going to counterattack that two in the center and go there and pick him up. Okay. And that's it. Uh, recon on the left. Alrighty. Okay, so we got the card we got last time was a two on the left, which is useless. Um, we can't target this guy. He's behind the river, on this side of the river. So uh, it's got to be an all on the right. And it's going to be this guy with three, two, one die. That's a hit. And we only need one more of those to win the game. All right, what do we get here? Oh, a direct from HQ. That's that's pretty good. <laughs> well, I don't have anything to order him. So I need to get these guys protected. And the best chance I have to do that is to do a two on the left. And they go three on the road. One, two, three. And one, two, three, and if he can survive one more turn, we'll put him on the river, try to get this guy back. Maybe this guy will even try to take this out. And uh, yeah, this is crazy. What a, what a great scenario. All right, so that's, yeah. Uh, pincer move. Uh, not great, not great, but I can get him onto the river next time if he survives. Well, here we go with the direct from HQ. And did that put him in range? Uh, three, two, one. He's in range. Three, three, two, two, one, one. He's not in range for him. But he is in range for him, and this might be our, our lucky winner. So we're going to go there. And he's in a church. So that's a minus one. And he can ignore a flag which he does, doesn't want to because he wants to get, get going. And then he might as well try to fire on him just in case. All right, so let's just do this one first since it's the game. Three, two, one on him. Tank symbol. <laughs> oh. Okay, and then two on the church. One hit. One hit and one tank. Okay. And he's done. And then uh, one on him from this artillery. Star. Wow. Boy, these artillery really, really uh, lost it here at the end, didn't they? All right. And armor assault. Well, that's basically worthless. It's a one of my choice, but crazy. All right, so again, I don't have anything for the center. So I'm going to do this recon and get him protected on the river. I'm going to do a recon there. He goes on to the raft. Can't shoot at anybody. And well, this guy can come out and shoot at him, but the artillery can't shoot at him. That's kind of what I'm what I'm looking for if he's not if he's if he can be targeted by artillery it's just a they're just gonna nickel and dime him so 
Um, yes, yeah, so that's it. And look at two cards and hope for a good one here. A barrage. Barrage is nice. Barrage is a nice card. Or an all on the left. Um, I don't have anybody on the left. And with a barrage, I could take him out. But still, I, I'd love to get a center card here. Um, yeah, let's let's keep the barrage. Might as well. Because I have cards on the left. This all on the left doesn't do me any good. Okay. And that's it. All right, I'm going to play that armor assault for the one of my choice, and I'm just going to try to work on this guy. And that's shooting two into the church. And that's one hit, one flag. The flag actually helps him. Okay, and I will not take ground in case I have to run after him. And then all in the center. I like that. Okay. Well, I've run out of center cards, so I'm going to play this barrage. I mean, I, I don't have, I don't have a, I mean, I've got to dig in, but that doesn't do me any good. I mean, it's, I guess it's a minus one, but it'd be a minus one for him. Hmm. Yeah, if I, I mean, well, if I don't get a center card, it doesn't matter anyway. I mean, although that that guy there is the game. If he if he rolls three and gets two hits, it's the game. So, uh, yeah, I got to do that dig in. I know this has become kind of a slog, but I'm gonna do the dig in on him just to get the die reduction. And please give me something in the center. All on the left. Wow. Jeez, oh man, this is. Well, that's how these are, you know. That's how the, these kind of scenarios are. It really, you get that one bombastic card like that artillery bombard, and you know, and then it can just kind of turn into a grind. So, but I'm going to play it out. I don't think it's going to take much longer. All right, we're going to do the all in the center, and hope for a lucky shot here to end the game. All right, let's do the artillery three three two two one one on that guy. That's a grenade for a hit. Okay. Put the pressure on. At least he'll have to jump into the river too for protection. And then uh, this one here with two dice and two hits wins it. A star and a hit. Okay. So. If I get something in the center, I'm going to be able to pull this off, I think. Three in the center. There we go. Nice. And uh, even if no matter what he does, I'm going to be able to get two dice on him. All right, here we go. Well, the dig in worked, but I don't have anything to order that guy. I have an all on the left, a two on the left, a two on the left. No units on the left. I've got a three on the right. No units on the right. I've got a pincer move, which is two and two on each flank and I've got no units anywhere so I got to do this barrage just for some fun and it's gonna be this guy and that's four dice and it is uh, what is it symbol symbol or grenade so it's grenade and flags can't be ignored <laughs> you have got to be kidding me look at this roll Four infantry symbols. A flag would do it. A grenade would do it. Four infantry. Holy cow. Well, maybe I'll get a center card now. Two in each. There we go. Finally. If I can survive one more turn, <laughs> I know how many times have I said that? <laughs> Not just in this one, in all these games. How many times have I said that? Well, I can just survive one more turn. <laughs> yep, good stuff. All right, so three in the center. And we'll just do him, just in case of a wild miss. And him, and this guy, three, three, two, two, one, one, on him. 
And that's an infantry symbol for a hit. Okay. And this guy here with two. And a hit wins the game. Grenade and a flag. So that does it. And he was, this prisoner I think was in the church. All right, so that does it on this one here. Um, great scenario, really great. Um, I would I would play this anytime. It's really good, real swingy, which is fun. You know, real real gamey, which is fun. Um, you know, some people don't like that. They want it to be more of a simulation, but I don't know. I think it's fun. I I, I like the swings like that. You know, I mean that artillery bombard card came out and. And that huge turn for the Axis was just uh, was soul crushing. And then you see a couple things, and you're like, okay, well maybe it's not over, you know. And uh, you know, one card either way uh, would have been a would have been a different story. But yeah, I love this. I love this scenario. I love the idea that you got to get in, get them, and get them get back uh, real quick. Um, it's just it's great the way the the way the bridges are are blown and you have to get use the raft to get over the water and then you know you can cross over and then you have to cross back and um, the special rule about the artillery not being able to shell inside the river is great you know you could even say if you wanted to try to spin that a thematic way you know you could say well there's a bunch of buildings in the way and they can't really see where they're shooting and all of that but yeah, great scenario, highly recommended. Um, definitely check it out. But yeah, that's it. Uh, that's it for this one. Well, I had a blast with this one. I can't, I can't stress that enough. Really, check this one out. It's awesome. So, all right, well, we'll see you on the next one, and uh, take it easy.